today we're gonna do one day vlog at Ben Jackity Park. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! about the history of Benjagiti Park. Benjagiti Park is a medium park and national park in honor of Her Majesty Queen Sirigit in 1992, whose name is on 72 birthday of Queen Sirigit during the opening. It was officially opened in 2004. Benjagiti Park is considered to be the first forest park in Bangkok. Located in the Kong Dari district of Bangkok, Benjagiti Park was uh, originally, this area is the location of a tobacco factory. So this path was a part of the project replacement area from resolution in the government of Prime Minister Anand Prayarshan. It had been transformed into a private park in the hearts of Bangkok. In this place, have a lot of tree, a lot of tree, even small, but we have like a lot of tree here. They have been adding using more local plants in Benjakiti Park. There's a, a over 200 different type of plant design. Most of them are arranged into an uh, agroforestry garden, considering of native plants and aquatic plants. So Benjakiti Park has become a popular destination for outdoor recreation, health park, playground, walkway, bicycle lane pavilions and parking space oh also an exercise in bangkok the good thing is this place has become a learning area about plants in the different ecosystem also to concern native plants that are decreasing in the number all right guys the place is right behind me. This is Bentagiti Forest Park. And Bentagiti Forest Park is really famous because this place is located at the middle of the city, which is mean that it's gonna be easy for us to get here. So if you guys want to come to this place, there are so many ways to get here. First one is bus, second one is taxi, uh, grab service, your private car, or even BTS. If you come by BTS, you need to get off at a soul station. And after you arrive to a soul station, you need to keep walking for like around 400 meters and you will get to Bentagiti Forest Park. And the last one is MRT Blue Line. MRT Blue Line, you will have two choice. First one is Queen City Gate National Convention Center Station and Sukhumvit Station. If you use your Google map, you will see that Queen City Gate National Convention Center Station is near with Benjagiti Forest Park. But actually, you have to walk like around almost one kilometer to get to this place. So you're gonna be really tired. So I, will, I would recommend that you better get off at Sukhumvit Station. And after you arrive to Sukhumvit Station, you will see the sign that will tell you how to go to Benjagiti Forest Park so you need to keep walking for like around 400 to 500 meters and you will be alive Benjagiti Forest Park so you can see the difference between these two stations that which one is better for you so now I hope you will have this choice so uh, maybe someone might wonder that uh, how do I get here I would say that I came by MRT Blue Line because I also live near with MRT so 
it's really easy for me and it won't take a long time for me to get here so I always use MRT to go this place and I love this place so much and I hope you guys would come this place and having fun around because it's relaxed and chill and it's really peaceful so I hope you guys would come and like you can like Post it on social media or having fun with your family or anything, and I hope that you will come. It's a very really peaceful place and uh, less pollution are less pollution than allow the Bangkok place. This place is a uh, really big, so many people can enjoy this place by walking, take a walk, exercise, or picnic together. And this place have a three identity of this place that many people like to come. The first thing is the bridge inside the the, the garden. Uh, at night, this bridge will open the light. The hope at the whole, the whole way of the bridge. bridge so it's a very beautiful at night so many people would like to come here to take a walk or take a photo together with family and friends and the second is the big pool behind me like this one so this this pool have a service that you can ride a boat ride a boat together with your friends and family they have a service it's a free and try so you can enjoy this at the pool and the last one is uh, the bridge connect to the Lumpini Park. 
So if you want to continue to Lumpini Park, you can walk from here to Lumpini Park by the bridge. And uh, it's a long way, but it's a new experience. So you can enjoy take a walk with your friend or family. And this place, Benjakiti Park, is a uh, aso, aso. Benjakiti Park is a uh, at aso, and in the aso area, have many foreign like to live around here. So that's why many foreigners would like to come here with family and friends to take a rest or enjoy the place. And Benjakiti Park is a uh, beside of Queen Silikit. So in the uh, Queen Silikit Center, have uh, many mini mini mart and restaurant. So people like to go there first to get a food and have a picnic in uh, Benjakiti Park. Yes, that's it. I often come in Benjakiti Park with my friend and take a walk together and exercise. And in my experience, I saw of many foreigners like to come here with family and friends. So I. I often like to come here. Yes. Why do you come in this park, and, and what do you like about this park? Mm, I come here because I live uh, near, so it's very easy to work from the side, uh, side ten, where the entry, and then uh, yeah, I like because uh, it's new. They make everything new with the light, everything there, and uh, not too many people uh, usually. I mean, I'm, Today's the main people of the day is quiet, so it's good, that's why I like to come. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, how do you feel about this uh, Benta Park? It's a very beautiful park. It's uh, very clean. Mm. A lot of things to do here. Uh, okay, thank you. Uh, how you feel in this uh, Benta Kitty uh, park? This park? Yep, this park. How, how you feel? Yeah, I love this park. Like, good air, you know, very re relaxing. A lot of people walking. I love it. Mm, okay, yeah. thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So cute,
Discord, Badminton, Checkball and Pickleball. You can booking online at the website jilakunthe.com and for basketball, football and table tennis, you can walk in and share the court with other players. For online booking, you have to go to the website jilakunthe.com Apply for the membership and you can book in the spot that you would like to play. And for stadium booking rules, one member can reserve use of the court for one hour at a time per activity per day. If you are at the stadium more than 15 minutes late, you will lose the court for the walking members. Those who love the adventure, you can come to kayaking or spinning board. I think it would be fun if you come with your friends. And the service is open two times. The first time is on 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. And the second time is 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. And you can use the service for free just one hour. Let's go. Spinning board. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoy our videos.